Hello everyone, welcome back to how to play this Dead Cells, not a daily today. We are taking a rapier and a shield, which seems very musketeersy to me. Uh, hang on a minute, what? <laughs> hang on a minute. Why were the musketeers all about fencing? Am I thinking of something else? Was it musketeers? The three musketeers were all about fencing, right? Why weren't they about musketing? Ow, that didn't go too well. Like, surely musketeers have nothing to do with fencing. How are you doing that? I don't like that. So the rapier is roll then stab, right? Yeah. I like both of these weapons. Well, both of these items, actually. I was gonna, <clears throat> I was gonna say that this might be one of those, um, one of those. Uh, Runs where we're gonna appreciate the fact that we can. Ah, sorry, I'm trying to talk and stab things at the same time. Uh, I was gonna say it's gonna be one of those runs where we're gonna be appreciative of the fact that we left behind a few of the um, uh, the the low cell left to unlock thingies. But I think a roll and then a stab is just as good as a backstab. In most situations, and in some cases, more so. Oh, I haven't got enough money for that. Uh, because the backstab one does kind of improve, uh, imply that you successfully got behind them, and historically I have had a little bit of trouble doing that. Uh, whereas in this situation, I I don't have to get behind them. Oh, I've got a bit of a sneezy nose. But um, the, the period of time in which you can actually um, stab them after a roll is much shorter than the period of time during which you can actually be behind an enemy, which is uh, uh, it's unlimited. There's no limit to the amount of time, although obviously the time does limit itself. Eventually, um, here, have this. You, you, you are basically, as long as you can be behind the enemy, you are doing that sort of damage to it. So the more we can do that, the better. You don't keep, please roll, thank you. Why did you not roll? This uh, shield is doing bleeding on things that are... It says nearby, but that's actually very, very wide range, to be honest with you. Might as well take this. Oh! I'm going to stick with a shield run. I did think about it for a very protracted period of time. I don't know if you noticed. Um, but... Please leave me alone. I've already got fire in the form of this grenade, and as... Mentioned in the daily recently, um, I don't want you to pay that. I, I, I think that <clears throat> grenades are fine as long as you can get those mutations that improve them, which I think I'm going to do. Mind you, I have taken a survival and a not survival run so far. Have we read this? Some writing was difficult to read. Malays, they're all affected, not die here. Can I have a thing? Is there a thing? No. Uh, <clears throat> if I can get this grenade to cool down more quickly, it's going to be good. But if I can't, well, we're going to have a bad time. Uh, more enemies, please. I can see a space over there, though. Is there something else? Hang on. There's got to be something up here. Ah, look at me. I'm amazing. Must be the prisoner's things. Thank you for the money. Very tempted to go and buy that, um... That, um... What should we call it? You know, that hunter's grenade. Ah, uh, I don't know. I don't feel confident enough about this game, this, this run right now, to suggest that we're likely to be able to... Um... Ooh, didn't appreciate that. Thank you. That's 30, good. Uh, I don't know if we're going to be able to get to a level where there are enemies that have things for us. Did I just completely bypass something? I don't think so. I feel like I did. Never mind. Let's go. Uh, toxic sewers is fine. Do I want to do the ancient sewers? Maybe. We'll see how well we get on. First thing that's going to be important is what we get for our reward for beating 30 baddies. Uh, that could make a, a big difference to us right now. The money helps. It's a little bit too late. Don't care about the impaler. Less damage, but money. And the crusher. Uh, I don't like the impaler too much. I like the idea of less damage received, but I also like the idea of just dodging better. And that's a, a very good crusher. Generates a shield when used. 
This is difficult to know, and I think I'm going to take this one. And the only reason I chose that one over this, the amulet, which could have been much better, is that the amulet is giving me a point in a, uh, a stat that I'm not using. And the one that I do have uh, is boosted by a stat that I am using. So, just that, really. Using health person as 345 people. I wonder if we, um, this is a brutality survival weapon, which is nice. Let's try it. We need to unlock it anyway. We've done the rapier before. So, can't sell it, so I'm not going to try. Um, we'll just put the rest of it into something else. I guess we should have unlocked Wings of the Crow, actually. <laughs> I just realized that's the thing that we uh, have previously appreciated. We might as well spend this, because we've got a lot of money for doing well. Critical hit deals damage. Greater plus. Fighters crawl from the dead. That's fine. So now we're going... I've gone pretty much hard on the... Uh, <laughs> hard on. I've gone pretty much uh, good on the old um, survival thing here. So maybe I don't want to take the grenade mutation after all because it's a red one. Let's see what we've got. We've got a lot of survival mutations. Reduce the cooldown of your skills with each successful parry. That's probably also a similar one. Counter attack. attack. Following a successful parry inflicts 207 damage. That's really good. Seems really good anyway. The efficiency of food. If you recycle, you receive... DPS. That seems terrible. Because <laughs> I'm never going to recycle and food just, you don't carry it with you. You know? Those are such I think throughout a single run I may pick up two or three pieces of food. I may recycle a, a few things but not whilst I'm in the presence of any enemies. Although 300 seconds is quite a long time for... But is 69 DPS good? I, I don't know. Uh, this one seems good. This one seems good. This one seems good. Because we're probably going to be able to parry quite well for the next level, because the next level is the easy version of the uh, sewers, I'm going to take the one that causes more damage. And then later, I think, what we're probably going to want to do is take the one that uh, gives us HP and cooldown. So those are the three that I'm thinking of taking. But if we do replace our grenade with something else... <coughs> excuse me. Uh, even so, actually, we've got the, um, the crusher, which obviously has a cooldown, so... Where's the crit? There we go. Okay. So there's a, a long attack on this. Ah, oh, you bollock it. Um, so the actual crit position there is quite difficult to find, especially in uh, tight quarters. So this may not be the best weapon for, for this. Can I hit this? Sure, why not? And I immediately find. Yeah, I can't hit this thing. Nice. Uh, I, uh, the the shield, no, the 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 whip thingy here is probably not the best thing to have right here, right now. Superstar DJ, here we go. But I do appreciate the fact that this is a thing. And if you can get it at the right point, that does a lot of damage. It's a lot, a lot of damage. So it's going to be one we have to get used to. Uh, but I think this is a good run to get used to it. So how far away is it? This far away? Yes. Ooh. So I've already picked up as much uh, food as I would normally expect to on any given run. Ah! That was just awful timing, if you don't mind me saying so. This may be a slower run, if you don't mind if you don't... Uh, I, I seem to have picked up the affectation of everything that I say is if you don't mind me saying so, which actually just sounds like I'm very... Uh, <laughs> very uh, insecure in what I'm saying which is true and maybe I should be more comfortable with the words that spew forth from my mouth whilst I'm trying to not pay attention to what I'm doing so that my hind brain can take over and let me play the game without um, excuse me run nice without um, really thinking about it and if I can play the game without thinking about it then I'll do much better and oh why have you done this how many times do you have to learn not to do that? <laughs> it's a very simple thing. Don't do what you just did. Oh. Okay. So, if you duck and parry, you don't have to... I honestly thought that both of those attacks would hit at the same time. You don't mind me saying so. Uh, uh, I've become a caricature of myself, if you don't mind me saying so. 
quite hard to get the uh, crit on that whip, actually. Nice. Uh, yeah, so this is going to be a bit of a slower run because I'm going to try and time things. Uh, what's, oh, what's, <laughs> it's a good question. Get this off the screen. Go away. Uh, I don't really want either. <laughs> I suppose we take Brutality because it's um, something we do have at this point in time, but I really don't know if it's actually that useful, especially long term, because the, uh, the weapon that we picked up, this whip, is a survival weapon. So I'm kind of thinking, oops, this is not a good time. I'm kind of thinking maybe we, um, let's get out of here. Let this thing explode over here. There we go. Uh, I think it may be the, the, the survival weapon is pretty good. Can I not grab onto that, please? <laughs> Thank you. Ooh! Ooh! Now, ooh, hmm. Oh, we've got two boomerangs or this whip. Do you know what? This boomerang does not have enough on it. Also, that's three times in this level already that I would have some six. Maybe the DPS stacks. That could be really good, actually. If I've got five minutes of DPS plus 69 DPS, that could be okay. If I've got five minutes of plus 69 DPS that stat three times, did you notice how he just refused to roll them? <laughs> I'm not into this. Nice. Nice! Do you think it's like one roll away from them is the point at which they are vulnerable? Aha! I have learned your secrets. Is this the get good campfire? This is a something changed campfire, but it says something's changed, and I go. But then, I'm dead for a while. Ooh. Nerves of steel is probably still not better than the whip. I'm gonna keep selling it because the whip is something we need to learn how to use, and I'm okay with it, quite frankly. I think we're doing okay. Where is the thing that changes, by the way? I wouldn't mind a comment. Uh, if anybody happens to know how one can find out what it is to change. Probably should use my skills a little bit more often because that did pretty well, I to be honest. It was just, this is good. This is fine. I'm enjoying the idea of taking it a little bit slower than we normally do. Um, maybe we should heal. I don't really trust the game to give me <laughs> HP without me begging for it, so I'm just going to take my own initiative to do that. Um, this is a powerful grenade, which I think I'm going to take it because it will scale with what we're actually taking. So as long as we continue to take survival, which I did, right? Probably. Got a lot of money. Let's, let's do it again. Um, yeah, yeah, I remember. As long as we continue to take survival, now everything scales with survival and anything that we find that has survival on it is good. And we can take all our survival mutations and basically we completely change the way we ever used to play the game. Uh, like, outright. <laughs> Nothing is the same. Everything you know is wrong. Nice. Uh, you take longer to hit me than I thought you were going to. You don't have much time in your... Nice! Thank you for jumping into the perfect range. Yeah, that's difficult. Sorry. It doesn't have to be easy every time. Something hit me, but I'm not sure what. <laughs> I genuinely thought I'd reflected both attacks. So this is a little bit confusing for me, because I'm obviously doing my best to get the, uh, the survival build to work here, but... There's many situations where I, I've just not got the hang of it, <laughs> basically. Uh, and so I would very much like the opportunity to get the hang of it. <laughs> Screw you. Uh, also, use your skills, because that's what they're there for. Um, so you have to bear with me, basically, while I sort of feel my way through what is essentially a completely new concept to me, which is actually using the shield for great justice. Well, this is going to go a little bit better than it did. Right. Please? No? Okay. Uh, 
trying to, because in some situations, like whilst I was talking just now, we managed to get a pretty decent situation where I, I hid behind one enemy and used the other enemy's shot <laughs> to own them both. Uh, and I felt good about that. So there are lots of sort of little tricks and turns for me to try and get the hang of, but stuff beyond that shop I didn't even notice. It's probably the way we want to go, huh? Wouldn't surprise me. Wouldn't surprise me in the least. So this may be a long episode and not have that much progress in it. This is kind of uh, a cardinal sin of playing this game right now is to admit that. I don't want either of those. I'm going to sell, <laughs> sell one of them. Uh, it's going to be a slow one, I admit. And it's also going to be possibly a bit of an abortive effort. But we are going to be learning and you're going to be watching me figure out a whole new bunch of stuff. A whole new way of... Uh, actually playing the game properly with uh, shields instead of just arsing around like a pillock all the flipping time. That nearly went horribly wrong. Yikes! My dude. Just have that. So coming up, first of all, coming up is the, uh, the ancient sewers, which I'm not going to do because I think it's probably actually wise to to continue with this run in a slightly easier fashion than I am necessarily used to. I still wonder what changed. Was it this? Ah. Uh, okay, I... <laughs> I'm gonna not, because it's red. And that's the only reason. Nice! I, I, I went quiet so that I could time that, and I did on purpose, and thank you for watching. I, I'm getting better at this. Uh, let's go to the ramparts because that's got enemies I can deal with. And I nevertheless will complain about every little thing that happens, but at least we'll know where we are whilst we're doing it. Whereas I feel a little bit more justified complaining in the ancient sewers because of off-screen enemies constantly attacking me whilst I'm trying to learn my way around a new system that I'm not necessarily very good at, and then... As a result, I, I take more damage than I even would have in, in the uh, original, and then, uh, whereas in uh, this case, I'll put uh, some in, but not many. Not all of them, I guess I should say. Because um, I don't want to change what we've got, actually. I'm pretty happy with all of this. That's really, really expensive, and I'm not going to do it. I mean, this is the one that we uh, got out of the thing, so... Actually, that's the one we got out of the thing. This one we just had. This is the one we got for um, unlocking it. So that's actually decent. So let's have a three plus. Um, the crusher, which is what we got from the thing, is not actually... I've not used it yet. Which is a shame, because if it had been anything else, I probably would have used it a lot more. Successful parry. See, this could be good, but I don't think so necessarily. Because I, I'm making use of the fact that parrying is just doing everything for me right now. So I think we recover HP and then next time we'll reduce our cooldowns because I'm not using my I'm not using my skills as much as necessarily I could be but I've got two and I'm only using one anyway at the moment so in this floor in this level I expect to start using my skills a little bit better so as a result I'm going to notice that I wish I had cooldowns uh, shorter cooldowns and then I'm going to be able to use those shorter cooldowns when we get to the end of it and of course we know how the ramparts works so everything's good this is hunky dory I think <laughs> it was my slappy squirrel laugh did you like it <laughs> well that was a good start timing on the thingy is still uh, a little bit beyond me got a, got a lot to learn I like that they still get stunned when I whack them like that. So at least I know that I have a little bit of an out if anything goes horribly wrong. Nice. Um, because, you know, I can just... Die! Die! Get him! Go! Yep, yeah, okay. This is fine. Uh, if I keep going carefully and slowly, we might even be able to make it to the 60 that I want to. But of course, I'm not going to keep going carefully and slowly because I'm going to run like the blue blazes, like arse on fire, trying to uh, get through the level quicker. Maybe wrong to run with stuff that isn't mine, but they're all dead anyway, so haha. <laughs> I'm going to read that. 
Didn't uh, didn't read the wiki on the law, by the way. No one, <laughs> no one told me whether to or not to, but uh, I just didn't. I'm going around to it, so I still don't know what's going on. I'm just uh, look, I'm just the janitor. I'm just here cleaning up the place. I honestly thought that I'd done that wrong. Thank you. I do really appreciate that when you do a successful parry on those, you get um, you get a sort of a piercing shot. That's really good. Thought maybe that was a. Uh... <laughs> oh come on! I don't need these. I'm going to take the one that gives me the most HP then. Um, otherwise, why, <laughs> why bother taking either? The only thing that I could possibly get from something that isn't survival right now is HP. So, might as well do that. Huh? Uh, I'm not going to tackle with these shield jokers because um, they could ru ruin my kill streak, which probably not that important, but it's still kind of important. So, oh, I didn't see that. Oh, I'm such a fool. Never mind. There's probably enough enemies left. I don't have to worry too much about that, but uh, I, I just got mind flooded with the fact that I was living in this one place. Trying to, <laughs> you know, get that one thing right, and then all of a sudden, uh, other stuff happened. I also appreciate that my uh, powerful grenade is also a fire grenade. I. Why did you take so long? <laughs> also, how did you hit me from behind? It's very rude. I don't think that's what they mean when they say, I've hit that. Does this ignore shields? Maybe. Uh, yes. So I can actually kill those things from the front, which is great because I hate them! And they need to die. That went actually quite well. Um, I wasn't quite sure what I was doing. I was just hoping for the best that everything I wanted to do, I was able to do in the timing that I wanted to do it in, and it turned out to work, but... Never do what I did there. What is this? Repeat a crossbow five, four. Okay, four. It's only a four. Uh, I don't think that necessarily is something I want. Although it is a green weapon. The critical hits aren't as good, but there's a lot more. Uh, I'm going to sell it. For reasons that are my own. And move on. I would very much like more enemies to be killed before they hit me. Nice. I'm gonna chuck more grenades and hope. That, oh, great! That was the best, I suppose. Nice. Oh, I haven't got a grenade. I tried to duck under the arrow there, but in fact, it didn't happen because the arrow <laughs> was above me because I found myself walking down a, a chain. Gosh, this game is very difficult to control. There's too many options. I don't like it. We could go far on this run, obviously, but um, expect doing so to be slow. Is that someone coming home? I'm not sure if the noises I'm hearing are real life or not. I don't think so. Well, if Jan comes in and surprises me, You'll all know what happened. I went, oh, there's no one here. And then it turned out there was someone here. You can have that, because I don't like you. You can have that, you can have that. Nice. I mean, it doesn't have to be, you know, a perfect shot you attack, right? As long as it hits a couple of times, they're dead anyway. So we are doing okay. We're doing okay. Don't panic. Not going to take it. No, no, no. Although, if I'm intending not to get hit for another... How many? 30 more baddies. Then, probably should open the chest. Okay, fine. Let's open the chest. And the reason is, I'm never going to get hit again. Because I'm now amazing at this game. Also, if I do get hit, at least the run is only 25 minutes long. And you didn't have to watch for too long while I faff around trying to figure out how the flipping heck swarm 3 plus plus I don't know if it's better honestly and I don't need the stat I'm going to sell it heck you you can't control me you can't make me want something just because it's got a bigger number that's just 
marketing. I'm immune to your marketing. I'm a millennial now. I'm a millennial now. Previously I wasn't, but now I am. <laughs> Oops, I did the thing again. Well, you just have to use it again. Oh, we ran out of enemies that I can kill. <laughs> oh, it makes it difficult because now I have to go into the fray and try and find enemies that I don't want to face. I thought you. Did I actually get that? Wow, the range on this thing is outstanding, actually. That was scary. <laughs> I probably could have tried to time the shield, but if I made that shield wrong, if I played wrong on that shield, I would be just be it, right? So I don't really want to risk it necessarily. Not for a, not for something as not for a mere biscuit, you know. Yeah, have this. There we go. Right, we can get hit again, so let's do that. <laughs> nice. So this is where we start thinking that maybe the parry with HP job is gonna be good. For us. Still trying to figure out the range of this whip, so you'll forgive me, I hope, while I uh, back around with that. Nice, but it's not all that easy. So maybe I should uh, snap her up in a butterfly net, pin her down on a photograph album. I am not worried. I am not overly concerned. Uh, okay, cool. Let's, uh, let's now run around like a blue ass fly because we can do so. The curse chest did not work out too well for us, but also we didn't end the run, so swings and roundabouts in my opinion. I must have got, yeah, I got hit before I got my 60 thingies, but uh, you can't win them all. You know, we took the chest because we're amazing and aren't ever going to get hit again. And that hubris, hubris came around to fight us on the ass. And, uh, no elite inquisitor, please. Do it again. There you go. Come at me, bro. Excuse me? Nice. I'm wondering if the Elite Inquisitor's uh, parried shot does more damage than the regular Inquisitor's parried shot, but honestly, I'm just glad to get through that because I didn't even want to aggro the Joker. Nice, 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 nice. I really appreciate that I don't have to worry about shields with this weapon. Okay, cool. Let's, um, let's get out of here, because I don't know if there's anything else for us in this map, so... Let's just go. There's probably a couple more scrolls, maybe one more scroll, maybe an item that I don't care about. I'm just going to sell anyway. Um, shame we didn't make that, but at least we managed to... I don't know. <laughs> what did we manage to do? We get more gold now. Great. Uh, I don't need the health flask for... Guess we start putting things in this, and then we've got a couple more things ready for the um, for the next run when things are a problem. Sure, 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 sure. It does more damage to things that are caught fire because of the other thing. Okay, so we wanted to get. Oh, we already got the HP one. Of course we did. So now we reduce our cooldowns. I think that's probably the best for me today. In future, we can probably start making our shield more offensive than it is defensive right now, but maybe we can just kill this thing with nothing but <laughs> nothing but shield attacks, uh, nothing but parries. I don't think so. No, I don't think so either, but we can try. Good start. You're too, you're too fast, actually. I don't appreciate that very much. Nice. Can't seem to get your range. There we go. There we go. So if you would care to sort of come over here. There we go. The uh, enemy is successfully walking through my effective crit range whilst uh, in between my shots, which is kind of pesky. Womp. Womp. Ooh. Wondering if we can parry... Wondering what else we can parry, basically. And probably not that, right? Nice! Have this. I got hit once, but that was because I was being a little bit pesky at the start of the start of the fight. Unfortunately, it counts. So I'm not going to get the uh, no-hit bonus. Oh, got hit there. Very good. Just 
keep at it. This is easy. And I'm saying this is easy to remind myself that this is easy, not because I'm finding it easy, which is painfully untrue because I'm getting hit several times, despite the fact that I know exactly how this enemy fights. My range is like off by an umpteenth of an inch. There we go. Nice. Yeah, I have this. And this. Whilst you walk towards me, here we go. Oh, it's too far away. Nice. Come on then. Bite your legs off. Save yourself. One more. Hey! I think we could have done that without taking any damage, but uh, sad to say, I didn't. Uh, no, thank you. And maybe. 920 DPS versus a hell of a lot more DPS. Okay, I'm going to sell that. If I can get the hang of this whip, uh, we are on Golden Gate Bridge. What are we on when Cloud9? Something like that. We're on the home straight anyway. We're doing well, is what I'm trying to say. So you can have everything because I rarely see you. I mean, I say you want a, a, a floor, but I don't have anything for you. Um, a lot of the time because I only get what comes out of that, um, that thingy. We should go to the sanctuary. I honestly didn't think we'd get this far, which is why I don't currently have the um, the hunter's grenade because I expect in here there are definitely elites that we could form to create a hunter's grenade and then of course completely fail at because it's going to be the uh, it's going to be the pesky it's going to be the, the golems that we have to fight no doubt nice still getting the hang of this but at least I think I actually am getting the hang of it this time yeah have this don't appreciate your uh, your your difficulty with me right now. Thank you, good sir. Use our shield a little bit more because uh, it will heal us. But I also don't want to use it because I'm bad at it. <laughs> that didn't really help. Expecting uh, a more egregious response from parrying that particularly pesky shot, but I didn't get anything, which is upsetting in the extreme. Three, uh, three kills. Don't expect to get through this thing with <laughs> getting hit every 30 seconds, so wouldn't worry too much about that. Ow, see? Nice! You get that right. Well, boy, do you get that right. Also, I could probably just parry those, uh, there you go. Nice. Could probably just parry the uh, shots from the ghost things there, couldn't I? Probably a lot easier. I know there's an elite one. I saw it, don't worry. It goes very slowly. It doesn't do as much damage as you might like. But it seems to be at least an effective way of... That was really, really bad. Apologies for my terrible play. <laughs> But there's not a lot you can do about it, so you just have to watch and suffer it like I do. I have to suffer my terrible play as well, okay? It's not just you. You know, we're we're in this together now. This whip is awful at short range, quite frankly. This is fine. Just keep at it. These don't count as HP parries, by the way. So that was a bit annoying. <laughs> what is this? Uh, okay. That's actually better. <laughs> and it, it just is better, I think. Cool. Also, it's still green. So I don't think there's any diff any reason not to take that. Please let me up here. I want to fight this elite, even though it may be a terrible idea. We should heal. We don't really do that very often anymore. So. Yeah, what? Didn't see that. Stop. I hate this. This little thing. This is the worst thing. Go away. Leave me alone. Nice. Yes. He's done it. Back of the net. A topaz amulet. I don't care what it does because it's better than the other one. That was hard, but we didn't actually lose that much HP doing so. That, um... That thingy that was zapping me was 
pretty pesky, but not like... You know, it, it could have been a lot worse, is what I was thinking, because I actually thought it was doing me a lot more damage than it turned out to be. Nice. That crush is better, of course, which is why that went well. Let's just uh, have a look down here. There is the other teleporter. There's a scroll of power. We should get it. I'm fully aware that there's a golem <laughs> waiting for me in this bit of the, the level, so I'm a little bit scared of that. Our HP is good, and our defense is even better. So I don't think I need to worry a whole great deal. Nevertheless, I am. I think what I'm worried about at this point is now a sort of an expectation of me to do well. I, I noticed there's a second door here, down here. So uh, let's try and fight this golem without actually ruining our day. Okay, never mind. Remember, go carefully. This is a slow mode run. Uh, mostly because you're doing things that are kind of new. That you're not very used to, not very good at. There's no harm, there's no shame in, in, in admitting that you're not very good at the things. Really? Probably should just uh, parry that, huh? Come back here. I would like to just hit this. There we go. Ooh, goal. Nice. The, the distance on that is really hard to figure out. If you're not hella used to it, which I'm not. Wrong one. Nice. Yeah, I'm not going to get the hang of the distance on that for quite a long time, I think. But this is kind of why I kept the... Um, this is why I kept the, the, the thing going, because... I don't have the hang of it, right? Uh, I, I could have taken the cock out and picked up the the, the the assassin's blade that I'm, you know, partial to. I chose not to, largely on the theory that it's going to be uh, good for me. Whoops! Please roll. I uh, didn't not take damage from that. <laughs> I can't tell the note. Drums tick. Yes, please. It's true that drums tick. Ow. Can't, um, can't punch it, can't whip it, and then roll out of the way of the shot. Very upsetting. Clock tower. We could leave. How do you feel about leaving? We haven't picked up anything of real value or import just yet. Also, more survival. So let's, uh, let's go for that. Also, also. Secret? No. No secret? No. There's a grimoire. Let's see what it says. I'm just going to stuff all over the island. What's he on about this time? Research notebook. Time is running out. Literally, with all due respect. Can't contain the malaise forever. Something strong. Contain the malaise, and I have come along and opened it. So, <laughs> all the malaise is out. Maybe I am my own past. Maybe I'm the worst enemy and uh, best friend of this whole place. This is the clock tower, right? Yes, let's go up there and see what that treasure type room is. And then I think we're just gonna leave because I'm scared. Uh, I have to beat a clock tower. Remember in the last episode, it's been a while since I recorded, so um, I do, yeah, no. <laughs> I do recall in the last episode that um, I got as far as the clock tower and I was happy with it because of the style of run that I was playing. And this is true again. Uh, but in this situation, um, I mean, it's the same thing, actually. I don't know if I can beat the the clock chat in the situation that I've got myself in with just a shield. So, I guess we'll see. Yeah, there's no way we're going to get through that episode only hitting 60, uh, not getting hit in 60, 60 baddies. So, I think we've got everything that we want right now. We did take this. We can't upgrade it. But we can reforge it, poison, explode, toxic cloud. Uh, I'm happy with it, actually. Those are pretty decent okays. We're going to have to get a lot better at this game, and a lot of that is probably going to come down to uh, parrying at the correct interval when you're doing something difficult. Like, this is a clock tower, actually. It's not even the, the clock master. It's not the clock room. We have to get up to the clock room. Oh, heck. All right, fine. Well, now we know. Nope. It's spaces like that that make me wish I now had five minutes of extra DPS. <laughs> I have been a little bit more aware of how often I'm selling things and, of course, picking up food. 
Uh, it's more often than I originally gave it credit for in the... Just leave me alone. <laughs> Uh, kind of expected more of a... The timing! It's always about the timing. Yes. You see, some things have an exclamation mark and you have to put up the shield immediately. And some things, when the exclamation mark shows up, that's the worst time to put up the shield. Because your shield runs out before they actually hit you. You just gotta know. It's just a matter of knowing. It's practice. Which is why we get worse as we go further through the game. Because we don't have that sort of built-in knowledge just yet. Where are you in the range of this thing? <laughs> there we go. Just when I didn't need a crit, I get one. That was fine. Don't mind that. Hello. Don't like it when you get up and do the thing. It's not funny. So stop it. I think taking the whip has been a problem because we tend to have to be close to things in order to um, to parry them and then far away from things in order to hit them with a whip. Nice. So uh, I, I actually honestly think I would like to replace the whip. Which, yes, I'm going to keep saying whip because... Uh, no reason. Where are we today? Oh, I've done nothing but talk about this run. <laughs> it's one of those. Break room. A break room for soldiers, nothing special here. Message. Set this message, perhaps. The alchemist experiments are getting us nowhere. Let's follow the king. We have to lock up the sick and protect the people. Long live the king. I've not seen that one before. Also, how do I... Can I get up there, please? Please, may I get up there? I can see something. Let me up. Ah, there we go. Aha! <laughs> That's what I was thinking. Why did the soldier go to the trouble of hiding weapons? Every crossbow five. Okay. Um, I said I'd like to replace the whip, and I have done so. Whether this was a good idea or a bad idea remains to be seen, but I think at least now we have a weapon that will work after a parry. The difficult part, of course, is that the weapon... They're both secondary weapons. So the part of me that wants to, uh... Excuse me? There we go. The part of me that wants to use the... Shield is the same part of me as the part of me that wants to hit... Um... The... the use the crossbow button. Again with this. See, these have a different... That was wrong. I parried it and got hurt. Explain. Ow! I actually managed to interrupt my crossbow with my shield, which I didn't expect to work. Uh, that's good, because it means I panic shielded, which is correct, because that's how you play Smash Brothers as well. So, uh, I've got good instincts, I have to say. Even if you don't agree. Uh, I still have to say it, because I'm obliged to. It's part of the YouTuber content creator charter. I didn't want to do that, but it's okay. Sorry. Yay! That takes so long that a grenade will explode on you if uh, if you use it, so watch out. Uh, okay, cool. Well, it's, oh, hey. You know, it's a force field on a successful parry. Crew hits him with a battle score from the dead. Versus the thing we've had for the entire game. Absorbs 85% damage. Plus 100 damage. Sure. Well, there's no reason not to. Um, I can't sell that item, so I've actually been playing with that literally the entire game. That's, that's better. I like that. Have that. Have it to you. And we uh, wait for you to do this, and I send it back. Right? 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 right. 
Oh, where did that come from? Run away. I... Uh, the heavy crossbow takes so long to fire that I forget that you have to... Uh, see, I, I, I pressed that too early. I am fully aware of that. You don't need to tell me. Well, we're getting a lot of gold anyway from just killing things, so I'm, I'm okay with spending that money. Oh. Let's talk about something else. This, this is boring. <laughs> uh, what should we talk about? How about... I should make a list. I made a wiki. <laughs> I made myself uh, a wiki.js installation on DigitalOcean Droplet. For those of you who don't know. What that means, ultimately, you know what a wiki is. You've all heard of Wikipedia. Um, the rest of it, DigitalOcean Droplet is essentially a... a the virtual machine uh, with which uh, it just gives you um, a, a place to run stuff basically so, the computer is, is, is it in the cloud I'm not sure it counts as necessarily the cloud now. why did all of that hit there we go <laughs> um, uh, I made a home wiki, a wiki for my house, for my household, no less. You can have that so that I can go down here. Um, and this is because I, I have terrible memory problems. I'm pretty sure I've spoken about this in episodes before. It's no surprise for everybody. And even, if it, even if I haven't, the fact that I think I might have means quite clearly that I can't remember anything because... I mean, you think I'd remember whether I'd spoken about memory problems in the past before. It's a pretty big deal to talk about, right? Uh, not really. Again, w one of the themes that I try to keep up on these episodes is reducing stigma around mental health and physical health, honestly, just disability in general. I mean, in the last episode we talked heavily about um, privacy on the internet, but this time... Not gonna. <laughs> Can't make me. <laughs> um, this time we're going to talk about mental health again because it's fun and everyone has it. Um, memory problems are a big deal, right? So I don't remember lots of important things. Oftentimes, uh, for example, conversations that I've had in which I should be remembering <laughs> important uh pieces of information like what we should feed the dog and when. I, I, I parried that. I'll have you know. Should have just shot you. This is not HP. I'm gonna heal. Um, yes, hold. It's fine. This is our first heal in the entire thing because our shield's been doing so well for us. Um, I made a wiki so that I can write things down and I've, got, I've already populated it with a, a, a reasonable amount of, uh, of information, including you know, I've got a lot of bank accounts in there. That was a good idea. Um, every month, we have several bank accounts. So every month, I, I make transfers from one account, from, from my account, the, uh, um, the main account that we get paid into, to... Um, is this where I want to go? Maybe. Uh, to, to all our various shared accounts. Wait, what? Oh, I see. I was up there. My mistake. Uh, I understood. Sorry. I thought I was over there. <laughs> I wasn't. Um. I can see a thing to the left there, but I don't know how to get to it. I don't see a way out of here, so I'm just going to keep going this way. Um. So uh, I never know how much or what accounts in blah blah blah. So I made a wiki page. <laughs> And it's got all of our transfers in it that we do every month. It's nice and simple. I've got a page on the dog. It literally has the dog's name written down on it just in case something happens and I forget what our dog's called or what we feed the dog or, you know, when she was born. I don't know. I'm never going to remember when she was born, for example, uh, where we got her from and all this sort of thing. Um, honestly, I think everyone should, everyone should have one because I can access it from everywhere. I can lock it down if I really want to. Um... And it's just worked out well. Can we reforge these? I actually replaced both of my things in this level, which is really good. Uh, I can't afford both of this. 
It's not very good though. It's even worse. It's even worse, worse. Fighters, fine. Uh, I was hoping to reforge the shield, but at least we got something. Here's a bit, by the way, where I'm not sure if we get through it, so... No, uh, just consider. There's, there's other ways of dealing with problems than just whinging about. <laughs> uh, I finally made a wiki. Wiki.js is kind of okay. It took me a little bit of a while to actually install it to a... Uh... Nice. Uh... Um, to a degree that I'm happy with, because... Uh, I don't even know if I just want to say that. What I mean is... Um... The software required an upgrade to various things that I um, can be bothered upgrading, basically. Oh, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. So I had to run it on. I couldn't run it on my own drop, actually, which is really pesky. Um, I would have liked to, but it wasn't an option because I had to upgrade Git of all things to a version that wasn't just broken. Um, which it's, I find it entertaining actually that um, even oh oh what I wasn't even looking I was stutting and shooting that was amazing I think we had the right um, skills to be honest with you I'm not gonna accept that I did well there I love the way he shrugs at the end of all of this swift sword five now and no we've got vengeance a new blueprint that's really good um, I, I take comfort in the fact that even at version 2.7 there was a bug in Git that meant something as simple as a, a node library for making... Oh, we shouldn't have spent the... Right, I get it. Um, a node library for making a wiki. Uh, it didn't work <laughs> because of some initialization problem or other, but I write software, that's my job. And it has bugs in it, and you always feel bad when there's a bug in it, and especially when people come along and the bug is affecting them to a considerable degree. That's the worst thing. Like, it's not just that they're, you know, affected by this bug. It's the degree to which they're affected by this bug. It's like, this is a really egregious and horrendous bug, and it should not be part of the... shouldn't be allowed, you know? How, how have I managed to do this to you? Please stop. Um, and yet, something uh, as prevalent, prevalent, you know, as Git, something that's used in every <laughs> every modern piece of software that you can think of is probably using Git one way or another, um, except for certain people who have problems with it. Uh, that was not great. Nice. Um, I can understand people having problems with Git, don't worry. Um, it's not like it's... I don't think it's infallible. But I do think it's uh, very much worth... Is this better? Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Where's it going? It's less damage taken, and it's an upgrade to survival. So I will take it, but under duress, quite honestly. Because I'll say under protest rather than under duress. Um, I don't necessarily want it. But I do acknowledge that it's probably better for us in our specific situation. That was not correct. That's not how you uh, do that. You do it like this. There we go. Very good. Actually, really appreciated that. Uh, do I want to fight these? Okay. Here you go. Let's do this a lot. Oops. Remember to uh, dodge the joke. Nice. Bang. Yes. Okay, good. These ones took me down last time, I, I do remember. Don't want a nutcracker. Get the heck out of here. Um, oh, there's a malaise bar now. I didn't notice that. Oh, and it goes away when you heal. <gasps> no one told me that. Nice. Um, so, it, it could take a little bit of solace if you're a software developer yourself that even people who release software that helps other people write software, even people like L Linus Torvalds, who's like the the Linux man, the person who brought Linux to the world, right? I, I don't even know who... Did he wrote it? Did he wrote it? Was he the person who wrote it? I think he might have been the person who sort of wrote it originally in the literal sense of long, long ago. But uh, I don't know if it is... 
I, I, I think he still has... He, he drives the ship. He steers the ship sort of thing. But I don't know if it's... Uh, I don't know if it's... I'm going to spend all my money. You can't stop me. <laughs> get a bunch of it back. There we go. I did get recycling too, so that's good. Uh, that had bugs in it. And, and such bugs. You know, it's not like... The thing about bugs is they're not bugs unless they affect somebody, if that makes sense. Um, Alright, we have to use our... <laughs> our bow is our primary weapon now. Go away! I thought I killed you yesterday. No, Abby. You didn't kill me. I tried to save I... I knew what was going to happen, but I didn't get it right. My bad. <laughs> I'm laughing at that. Um, I, I, yeah, you can take solace in the knowledge that even the the professionalist of professionals. That's the thing. It's like it's not just uh, other people in the world. Oh, oh, so just press RB. Um, it's it's like the, the the people who run the world in software, right? They are making these mistakes. And you know, it's comforting in some respects, and in other respects, it's quite scary. I've noticed, and I don't know if this is me or if it's uh, actually true, that the the time at which you fire your bow to get a crit is very, very similar to the time it takes to fire the heavy grenade at all. Uh, not the heavy grenade, the heavy crossbow. Guys, oh, run away! <laughs> They're not be here. This is a bad place. It's a scary place with bad people. Nice. Oh, you went away. I will uh, do this. I don't know if I want to fight this one. Oh, what's the worst could happen? I die. That's what's the worst could happen. Is. Win. <laughs> we win you a Merry Christmas. Nice. I think the fact that I've got biters, are they coming from the shield? Yes. Um, the biters from one attack <laughs> take out the next attack. Not oh, correct. This is going okay, if I'm being honest. Uh, I'm a little bit worried because it means I'm going to have to you know, prove myself when it comes to the actual final actual boss, which is a problem because I'm bad at it. Um, but it, it's another opportunity to practice, which is basically all we could ever ask for. I was, again, thought that my uh, bow and shield were switched around because they usually are. I didn't go too well. That was bad. Okay, that's fine. We don't have to be perfect with our uh, shield every single time, just often enough. That was bow. Go away. <laughs> you made me sad. I kill you. I kill you! Nope. I, uh, I think, yeah, the fact is that I'm actually absorbing 80 uh, something percent of damage, not 100 percent of damage. That's important. Also, I am in the wrong place. <laughs> so, get me to the exit quick, because I want to fight this boss and, and be gone. Uh, just going this way, I suppose. I'm assuming that it's on this side. It's over here somewhere. That's my um, instincts, but who knows? Who even knows where this boss is right now? Probably up here. Oh, wait, this is where we were. Oh, no, it wasn't. Okay, yeah, cool. Oh, this is right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ooh, a treasure to give us an amazing thing at the very last... I don't know. Again, I, I really don't think this is going to be good for us. I really wish it were. That's the trouble. I want biters to be 
way better than anything else, but I have to make a decision, and I don't know what the decision... I don't know what the answer should be. I really don't know. Uh, I'm guessing. Oh, that's the rapier. Nice, but no nice. That was a... <laughs> I turned thanks but no thanks into a, a slightly different... Hey, I'm getting frantic and urgent and it's scary, and I don't know what to do. So, leave me alone. Come back. Ooh. Blueprint. And a repeater crossbow, which I'm not going to take. Ha 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 ha. Fires multiple boats, bolts periodically in mobile enemies. It's got extra survival on it, which might be really good. It's got very good DPS. Not as good as the Nerves of Steel. I think it might be better, but I'm not going to sell my Nerves of Steel, just in case. It's not better. <laughs> I'm hedging every bet that I can find right now. That's the trouble. Feels better. Let's straight off the gate there. And die. Nope. Yep, yeah, fine. Uh, this is not where we want to be either. Where is the way out? I think it's down there somewhere? Near the way in? That would be funny. Ha ha. Very good. Appreciate being given the HP back as well, actually. <laughs> that was, uh... That was the explodey grenade. The, the, the... Exploding viscera of the original. Dude, being eaten apart by the, uh, eaten apart the the living viscera of the other dude. I don't want any of that, but I might as well take this. Give me some extra HP. Last HP of the game, maybe. You have got a thousand, ten thousand. Oh no! Hi 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 hi! Nice try, sunshine. Oh, oh! Nice flipping try. I think that's helping. I think the other thing is I'm not really prepared to change what I'm doing right now. Um, I've gone to the effort of... What? Um, I've gone to the effort of switching my thingy over, so I'm going to keep it. Very nice. Uh, I think the correct thing to do here is to go down here, clear these things out. Like this. Again, I'm, <laughs> I'm confusing myself with my shield because my shield and my... Uh, bow are basically on the same button in my mind, which is not right. It shouldn't be the case. Please let me out. <laughs> I want to go home. Oh, here we are. Yes. And I don't have to open the other key because I've done that. That was the boomerang. We won the boomerang. We've made it to the throne room, which is actually outrageous because I didn't think I was going to get very far at all with, with the shield run. Because Just from experience, quite honestly, soldier resistance. Increase your health by 4%. <laughs> Take three sacks after taking the hit. That'll be a good brutality run, actually. But let's uh, put all of this in here first. Unlock that. Might as well put some in here. That's got a lot of cells for it. Um, this is going to be it because I'm not going to do very well. <laughs> um, yeah, we kept our biters. Um, reforge modifier. No. I'm keeping it. I didn't sell my other thing. That's okay. I'm not going to keep all this uh, money when I die anyway. And you never know. We might not die. <laughs> I'm, I'm hoping that the HP that we get back from doing a successful parry is somewhere similar to the HP that we lose from having to parry in the first place. Um, but here we are. We've not been here for, very, for too many times. We haven't been here too many times in a row. Uh, this is like the third time I've seen this boss. So he's all like, bring it. And I'm like, all right, I'll bring it. That was weird. That wasn't very helpful. I didn't appreciate that, if I'm being honest. Can't seem to reflect those. He, he, he does push you in, which is a shame. So... Oh, you can jump on that, of course. Okay, fine. 
Okay, cool. Don't want that to be there. <laughs> That's not the correct place for that. Please cool down quickly so that we can uh, get it over and done with. Guys. Just one elite this time. What? What did I do to deserve this? Hang on. My nose is itchy. It's because I'm scared. <laughs> I don't know why. Don't even talk to me. It's the weirdest thing. Can we, can we have some more understandable telegraphs, please? Says the Englishman. Nice one. The telegraph is never understandable. Help. I don't know what to do. Help. <laughs> I don't know what to do. He keeps doing things and I'm like, what? How did you get to do that? It doesn't seem fair. Leave me alone, though. This is all it is. No matter of leaving me alone. I can't heal. I was holding the button. He was just standing there like a pillow. Bro, right, that's not that heal. We can't do shit after this. I, I, I don't know what he's going to do. This is the trouble. So I'm like, what do I do? You know? I don't expect any of these attacks to happen, and yet they keep happening. We're doing better, though. I've never got this far. <laughs> Is that a good thing? I don't know. Ow. Okay. Okay. Please, leave me alone. No! What I'm going to have to do here is get rid of this joke. Okay, fine. Nice. I'm just going to tank this thing over and over again <laughs> for uh, damage, for HP. It's not working because this thing keeps attacking me. I... My brain just got fixated on the fact that I was parrying that thing and it wasn't helping. I think I really needed to go right back to the start of this and learn how to parry the zombies. <laughs> that is the worst thing. The, the end of the game was ruined by the fact that at the start of the game, I don't know how to parry zombies. Because it's like I said before, um, the, the timing on the things, the exclamation mark showing up and then the attack is so wildly different that you have to learn each one individually. And of course, at the end of all of that, I, I had no idea what I was doing versus the actual hand of the actual king. But we lasted a lot longer. We got to the second round of elites. So I don't feel too badly about that, but what I do feel bad about is the fact that that was a simple, simple enemy to fight, and I just ruined it. <laughs> and I was trying to tank it to heal myself off of the parries, but because I'm so bad at the enemies at the start of the game, I couldn't use an enemy from the start of the game to help me at the end of the game. So that is just so poetic. It's so ironic. It's so perfect. What a way to lose. You know, is to recognize at the start of the game that I'm never going to get the hang of these damn zombies because the time between the warning of the attack and the parry of the attack is so big that I just can't... It's like it's the temporal equivalent of not being able to figure out how far away the end of the whip is in order to get a crit. You know, I, there's the human brain is good at like maybe a, a small timing interval and if you extend the time too long you start double guessing yourself and it doesn't have to be very long maybe a second right and i think that's what we get from that zombie is about a second long and i i'm not timing i've lost track of time to parry that so that's something i have to practice i'm gonna have to do another shield run this time it's the bloodthirsty shield again so we know that we're good at that and i'm just gonna go through in the next episode we are gonna practice the heck out of parrying zombies so that when we get to the end again which we're gonna do we can tank that zombie and heal ourselves from the terrible, terrible uh, uh, performance that was in between elite rounds. But anyway, thank you for watching this episode. I got so far and yet so far away from the end. But until next time, thanks for watching and I'll see you.